Hi everyone, in this tutorial I'm going to teach you how to calculate drag and lift force over any structure. In this tutorial our structure is a dam break uh, with a structure at the downstream of the flow. Let's show you the geometry first of all. Uh, it is our geometry and Yeah, uh, it is the structure that uh, the flow will be uh, flow will be fluid will be flow over this structure and to, this is the alpha dot water at the time one second one point one second okay you can uh, uh, you can choose your own time step to and you can calculate it in every time step now let's put this to normal okay the first part is you have to extract block the block which uh, you are going to calculate drag and lift force on it you go to search extract block you click on extract block and in our case uh, our structure's name is cross blockage apply yeah. this is our block the next part is that you have to extract your surface extract then apply Okay, um, the next part, in next part, we will compute cell normals. In drag and lift force, we have to compute cell normals. In this tutorial, uh, our, dra our drag will be in each direction and lift force will be in Y direction. Again, we go to filters, search, generate surface normals, it's here. Okay, and you have to click on compute cell normals so we will have a file okay if you go to this part you will see normals it is normals okay. the next part uh, is the last part we go to calculator click on that we put uh, cell data first we will calculate drag force okay and these colors pressure multiply by its normals then apply okay we can change its name Okay, we can write drag force. Okay. And we go to calculator. Cell data. We write lift force. Then again, pressure. Multiply by. normals y apply we change its name to lift force okay the last part we go to we should integrate this lift and drag force in over our structure we go to filters we write integrate let's yeah we haven't choose any of them first then filters 
search integrate integrate variables okay then apply okay and you choose cell data as you can see we have drag force it is our drag force if you have if you want to have your leaf force you click on leaf force then you go to filter search uh, integrate variables okay then apply okay. as you can see this is lift force I hope this tutorial was helpful for you and thanks for your attention.